Okay, Dakota, this is this uh, file is for you. This video is for you. Here's the web page canvas with a PNG file and the cards BU.mix. I'm going to download both of these. I'm downloading that. And I'm going to download the zip file right here. And I'm going to drag these over into the directory that I'm going to run from. Okay? So here's my directory that I'm going to run from, and I'm going to open up MATLAB, the cards be you, okay, and I'm going to unzip this file here, okay, which is going to create the PNG file where all the, the images are. I double click on one of the images, and it pops up the image of the two of hearts. You see the two of hearts, two of diamonds. Okay, there's the two of diamonds. Okay, so now what I want to do is I want to access them through my little program, this dot MLX cards BU.MLX. Okay, and hopefully, right now it looks like the uh, it appears that uh, MATLAB has frozen. It has. Okay, so let's try again. Okay, we're going to try MATLAB. I'm just going to click on the icon to open MATLAB and see if it opens. Okay, it opened this time. So here I am in MATLAB, and I am going to go to that directory, which is my classes. Classes, and it's class 21, and I'm going to set add path selected folders and subfolders let me move this up a little bit so you can see it add path selected folder and subfolders for that 21 you see my pngs there with all my cards here's my cards.bu i just opened it up okay and because my path is set and i run this Boom, I get the seven of spades. I run it again. Three of hearts. Four of diamonds. So all the card, the image names are stored in data store. The subroutine is what did that. N equals cards. That's my function right there that stored all those names. Okay. And here's my random number generator, one through 52. If I show you each time what card it's doing 50 is the queen of clubs okay 51 is the king of clubs okay nine is the ten of spades and so on so this should allow you to take care of this problem